Hey guys, Silversaurus here, and welcome to another video. So, today, welcome. Uh, by the way, do you like the little upgrade? We have one of the ring lights, and I think it's made the videos look a lot more clear. Uh, it helps the camera focus a lot better. Uh, often it's dark when I'm recording, so you have the no natural light really from outside. Uh, so today we have, oh look, what's this? We have a little unboxing. Um, I've already obviously ripped them out of the packaging with excitement. Uh, we have two little pieces of gold here. Uh, so let me uh, whip them out and show you. Let's uh, take a closer look. So this is some Swiss gold. Well... And it's nicely tucked away in the packaging. <laughs> this little flip. Um, yeah, we have some Swiss gold. So, hi to any Swiss viewers we have. Oh man, come on, here we go. Right then, so we have the dirtiest hands on YouTube unboxings. Um, but also, there we go. So, we've got 1883. This is a Swiss 20 francs in gold coin. So it is 900 silver, so 90%. Uh, the coin is obviously from Switzerland. Uh, on the back, the front, whatever side that is, we have uh, this chap here. Uh, so pretty nice design there. Uh, and also on the front, let me just uh, zoom in. Obviously got the 20, the date, and we'll start at the top. Uh, and the second one is the same coin. Um, on this one, it's a different year, though. So this one is, like I say, same, same, but different. Um, there we are. So 1908. And you can just see the little B there next to the 8. Uh, that is the burn mint mark. So yeah, two twenty francs. Um, like I said, they're ninety percent, uh, and the total weight of the coin is six point four five grams, uh, and therefore a fine weight of 5.81 grams so comparing to a sovereign which is just under eight grams um total weight these are obviously a little bit smaller uh, and obviously therefore cost less um differences from the sovereigns you've got uh, 90 percent compared to the 90 91.7 I think the sovereigns are. Uh, what else? Yeah, obviously the sovereign is a little bit bigger. But uh, I like the yellowy colour of the Swiss coins. They are slightly different between each other. Um, like I say, slightly different designs. So, uh, yeah, that's today's unboxing. Uh, what do you reckon? Have you got any Swiss gold? Uh, do you like them? Would you would you buy them? So I bought these because they were a very low premium, uh, lower than a sovereign by nearly half of the premium of a sovereign. So sovereign premium was four and a half percent. These were two percent premium. Uh, there was three of them. So I basically logged on. I saw them and thought, oh, that's a low premium and quite a cheap coin for a fractional. So. Gave it a click, three available, put them in the basket, and uh, said sorry, only two available. So I only got two um, when I put my card details in, and uh, there we go, we have two of them. So, yeah, I, uh, I'm obviously not doing a very good job of, you know, refining the stack to more uniform pieces. Uh, and I'm not doing a very good job of washing my hands. Uh, I've just finished work, so I will be uh, having a shower soon, don't worry. Uh, and then I won't be a filthy mess. But 
just excited to uh, whip the coins out and have a little look. So I have something else coming up soon, uh, another gold piece, and just, um, you know, carrying on uh, some spread betting, making some money on the prices going up and down. Uh, did get a nice little short there on the crypto market. Uh, two different crypto coins I shorted on uh, the afternoon yesterday. Uh, that was a very nice uh, wake up this morning. Nice bit of profit there. So, yeah, we have, uh, let's say we have some gold on the way. I'm planning to get some silver, ideally. Um, I'm just, yeah, I'm just sort of hesitating on buying some bigger bars. Uh, just mainly due to, I want something that's a bit, you know, that's liquid, nice and liquid. Um, if I can, uh, you know, get some 100 ounce bars, the premium is lower. But then maybe the potential buyers will be a bit more limited when it comes to sell. So we'll see. Um, these two gold coins, I might flip them. Um, I keep saying that with all the small pieces I'm buying and I've, I've still not sold any gold. <laughs> so uh, probably not, but maybe. Um, that would put me, by the way... Uh, well, with what's coming in the post uh, tomorrow... I should be around about the 12 ounce mark and uh, there's a reason why I think 12 ounces is a good number and we'll discuss that on another video. So hope you've enjoyed the video guys. Silversaurus over and over <laughs> over and oh come on <laughs> typically See if this works. There we go. Over and out. Have a good one, guys. What a coin. Still think it's my favourite. <laughs>